I just was sitting up here thinking, I haven't lived. I haven't lived. I think the only reason that you're listening to me right now, the only reason that you're watching this webinar, that there's somewhere in your heart of hearts that you've said, as you looked at your life, you said, I've had it. And not only have you said, I've had it, but you've said also in your heart of hearts, I can do better than this. It has been said that most people fail in life not because they aim too high and miss. No, most people fail in life because they're just like I was for 14 years. They aim too low and hit, and many never aim at all. I refuse to die an unlived life. I refuse to die an unlived life. If there's ever time that we need to begin to stop and think and assess ourselves, that time is now. I've been working hard all my life, paying bills and taking care of my children, and my children are gone, and I've just been thinking, I haven't done anything. Because if I died right now, I would be mad. My goal and objective is to die young at an old age. Because if you don't have a goal for being here, being here is not a given. Most people don't make 60. Most people don't. People just take it for granted that they're going to be here. I want you to say to yourself, it's possible. It's possible. And I want you to follow along with this process. What's your plan? What's your goal? Many people die at age 25 and don't get buried until they're 65. How's this affecting me? You know, we want to all become successful, but I've found that there's some success that's toxic success. You don't want to end up going after goals and dreams and neglect yourself. I want you to think about your goals and dreams and things that you want to achieve. And at the top of the list, I want you to put up there your strategy for being here. That's the most difficult thing that I've ever done in my entire life. To believe that I have the ability to live the life that I'm now living. I refuse to die an unlived life.